Do you want to argue on your own behalf or, or of, on behalf of somebody who's not here but might want to take this position? Yeah, actually, it's not that important for kids to have parents be married. Okay, so I have a I I go back and forth on this and because here's why. there's a lot, a lot, a lot of in sociology and then the legal literature, there's a lot of things about like, no, 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 marriage is important because it is important right. for kids to have their parents be together. Right. But I feel like that's like a bunch of old stuffy people saying that, and I feel like all I the mean, hip kids are like, no, 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 it's fine, like. It takes a village, and it doesn't matter. And Murphy Brown. I mean, I love Murphy <laughs> Brown. I I think that there there is certainly in my mind a benefit to the security and stability, actual and perceived, by children to have married parents. Yeah. Like, I think there is a security and a comfort in like my parents are married. They're not going anywhere. Like they are together. They are going to be here for me to protect me and take care of me and provide for me and have a loving family. And we're going to have beautiful holidays together for the rest of our lives. Like where, yeah. you know, we all of our children come back to our house and we have one big, beautiful family. Not to get too specific. Not to get too specific or misty eyed. But where I start to question because I think I've heard this from friends who have had parents that have divorced. Yeah. Whereas it was very hard for them to go through when you have two parents that are severely unhappy and a part of this is a choice, right? And and yeah. choose not to make it work. Yeah. Sometimes that's more harmful to the kids of like living in a household of anxiety and frustration and yelling and so i don't know what the bigger benefit is like yeah. i mean i get like I, I know what your answer would be which is like hey you're two grown adult parents like work it out and don't let your kids feel the yeah. like but but kids do and and parents do and so you know like i've heard a lot of people who come from families of divorce say like honestly it was so much better for each of them i will say i've n i have very rarely heard them say like it was better for me right. i don't feel like i've heard that as yeah. much though i think that is an undertone of like you know we it was it was better like it was happier but i i think it, like all of those people in some way like yearn for their parents to be together like they wish that that had that was yeah. an option right like yeah. so i don't know so i i you're not coming down hard against the idea that parents being married to each other is a bad thing or a good thing. You're not, you're not anti that concept. No, no. Yeah. I think like that's the ideal. Yeah. You should have two married parents that stay together and work their issues out, preferably not in front of you. Yeah. Like, but I don't know, like I, I there is like the, the piece of, when does it become in the better interest of everybody to like not have a dysfunctional friction filled household? Yeah. Again, I, I think that's like going back to the, like the gambling thing, right? That's like a, it's a very multifaceted sort of set of considerations. And I do worry about sort of the self fulfilling prophecy of like, if you have the mindset, like you'll find a way to rationalize. Um, but yeah, I don't want to be totally dismissive of like, yeah, I mean, there's, there have got to be irreconcilably, you know, tense dynamics between spouses that like need to be acknowledged. Like I'm not trying to right. be like, everybody should just work everything out and everything like just, yeah. boot, you know, pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Like I'm not trying to say that. Yeah. But I do think that there is, I think there are not enough people in society today saying we should aspire to functional marriages and that divorce is a bad thing. Like, I feel like it's become yeah. more like yeah. contemporarily like, oh, it's fine. Like if you want to get divorced, you get divorced. If you don't, and it's like, yeah. I, there's nobody advocating other than like what people would perceive as like stuffy old, you know, members of the good old boys club that are like, oh, we should, you know, meanwhile, half of those guys are cheating on their wives and it's like, it always comes out in the magazines, but, <laughs> and then everybody rejoices that they're cheating. Right. It's just, yeah, I mean, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. but to say, I like, I feel like there, there are, we have gotten to a point where we're like, well, to each his own. 
to like a crazy extent where we are now not saying like, well, it would, it is better if we can do it to have families stick together. And so I think people are willing to step away for far, like far less severe things because they're like, like whatever, we're just, I'm just not happy. We got a divorce. It's like, I, I think they're, I think you're right that the like eject lever is easier.